Hi guys and welcome to the group. A quick video. Um, I'm writing the CPL but this is relevant to RPL, PPL, CPL. Um, the RAOs we've got absolutely spot on so this isn't that particularly relevant to those people. But it occurred to me as I'm writing the CPL because I'm about 20 hours in um, and I'm trying to cover all the bases and I'm constantly thinking right you know have I covered them all what could they get asked that I haven't covered but the problem is if I, is if I try and cover everything um, absolutely everything uh, it'll blow out to about 300 questions so what I'm doing is I'm making sure that I cover everything in the syllabus I've got the syllabus up on my other screen as I'm writing I'm going between texts and internet sources and the FAA and CASA and I'm trying to cover it all uh, all the syllabus points because it's only the syllabus points that you should get tested on now in doing so I'm acutely aware of this if I throw a question in asking about one aspect for example of memory you might get asked about another aspect of memory okay so what I want you to do is I've, I've told you that the fastest way to pass is to go you know, do a practice exam go straight to all your red ones which are the ones you got wrong then go to the index and then go um, to the content section learn it say it out loud say it out loud say it out loud then come back and do your practice exam now I still want you to do that right but when that number of red questions starts to dramatically reduce I want you to throw in an extra step what I want you to do is then I want you um, to start looking at your green ones and saying okay which ones in there do I know the least about okay um, which ones in there have I sort of only brushed over the topics on and go and look at those okay this is if you really want to make sure you cover all bases and especially for the PPL because from all the feedback I've got people are saying RPL is not too bad PPL is horrific CPL is not too bad okay so for the PPL people if you just want to make sure you cover all your bases um, and I guess for the CPLs as well then when once you're completing and you've got that number of reds right down then go through your greens and identify where potential problems are which topics you know the least and go and hit the index hit the contents uh, do a quick read say it out loud say it out loud say it out loud come back and do the uh, exams as well now again you know I'm asking you to um, look for areas that perhaps I haven't covered I know that if you can smashing out these exams you're gonna do well but just to make sure in case they ask you other things but also to cover your bases to be a safer better pilot as well so I hope that's helped guys I want to keep this under three minutes thank you so much we had our biggest month last month um, more people joined last month than in a third of last year which you know shows us we're doing the right thing in here and we're doing the right thing in the Facebook group and so get involved get active share please invite other student pilots and thank you so much Matt from pilotpracticeexams.com